Hey there, it is Kat, and today I've got a special guest, and her name is Mary Beth Quillen. And she is the director of a play going up in Grand Rapids at the Jewish Theater Grand Rapids called The Hat Maker's Wife. Hi, Mary Beth. Hi, how are you? Good. Thanks for joining me today. So tell me a little bit about, well, well, let's start off with Jewish Theater. How long have they been around? This is their 31st season. Wow, that's fantastic. Now, The Hat Maker's Wife, is it? A musical, a comedy, a drama, what is it? It's a comedy and a drama. Okay. It's a story about a young woman who moves in with her boyfriend in a house in suburbia. Okay. And they're expecting to, you know, live there, I think he thinks, happily ever after. And uh, suddenly the walls begin talking to her. Oh, my. Yeah, (laughs) it's... It's magical realism. It's a very realistic situation in a realistic place, but magical things happen. Wow. That, it sounds just like such a, a, a cute kind of fable sort of... Uh... Um, it's not really specifically a Jewish story, mm-hmm. except that there is a character from Jewish folklore, a golem, who ah, comes okay. at, in the second act and is another magical creature that makes some changes. Oh, interesting. Okay, so, it, but it's set in today, I guess, in well, the present, the, the, I should say. Well, the young say. woman lives in today. She's oh, contemporary. Oh, okay, all right. And the walls tell her about the past, the things that happened in this house in the past. Oh, how cool. So we have flashbacks. It just sounds so charming. You don't want it'll to give it away. It'll make you laugh, and it'll make you cry. Ah, uh, Okay. It's and, very touching and very real. It's the way real life is. Oh, and, and how did you get drawn to it? Well, they sent me the script last spring, and I read it, and I thought, well, I like the story. It's going to be hard to tell, complicated to explain to the designers and the cast, but let's go for it. <laughs> so, oh, very cool. So are there some special effects? There are. Ooh. A lot of the videos are, or a lot of the flashbacks are video scenes. Ah, and okay. I have beautiful music, original music being composed by Todd Lewis, and he's composing special hat music because when you wear a hat, you hear special music. Ah, how cool is that? Now, um, yeah. I was looking at your cast, and you've got some veterans um, in Grand Rapids Theater, and then you got one or two newcomers, right? Yeah. Um, Olivia Randall and C.J. Ron are our contemporary characters, the young couple. Okay. I I know (laughs) C.J. He's my son. (laughs) So uh, very excited to see this whole thing. And then you've got the veterans doing the flashbacks, correct? Yeah, I've got uh, Mike Smolensky Mm -hmm. and John Stevens Douglas in the part of John plays the hat maker, and Mike plays his best friend and next-door neighbor, Meckle. The wife is Sandy Kirchinger. Okay, and she's uh, a veteran, too. This is her too. first show for Jewish, but she's she's pretty experienced. Okay, and then you've got The Wall, and you've got The Golem. The Wall is played by Samantha Lucas. Oh, she's invisible, fun. but her voice comes from The Wall. Okay. The Golem is played by Ian Brown, and he's really a very physical actor and got all kinds of improv ideas that are just crazy oh my gosh the pictures are amazing is a animate anthropomorphized creature made of inanimate objects like clay or mud oh okay and they can be good luck or bad luck ah and that's from the jewish folklore right the golem yes that's the jewish folklore element okay wow well i'm super excited to see it um, and then, and then you want to mention your crew as well. I hear your assistant director is a special guy. Uh, yeah, my <laughs> special guy. He's uh, my partner in life and on stage, Gary Mitchell. Uh, the so he's my assistant director and stage manager. Okay, and uh, and everything is going to be opening up on February 29th, correct? Yes, we perform on Thursdays and Saturdays. At seven thirty, mm-hmm. and Sunday matinees at three. Okay, and it's two weekends in a row, so we close on March tenth. The theme of Jewish theater is you don't have to be Jewish to love Jewish theater. Ah, 
All right. Uh, the the hat maker's wife, and it opens February 29th and goes through March 10th. March 10th, and it's at the Spectrum Theater on the campus of GRCC. And where do we get tickets? Online at the website jtgr.org. Awesome, awesome. I am so excited about this show, Mary Beth. Thank you so much for joining me, and um, we're looking forward to seeing the show. We're going to have a couple tickets to give away as well. The Hatmaker's Wife, directed by Mary Beth Quillen. Thanks for joining me, Mary Beth. Thank you.